The tugboat, for its size, is the most powerful craft afloat. And the star tugs are the power behind the docks and waterways that make up the big city port. This is Tugs. Remember a time, we'd all had a long, hard day, but there was still one more job to do. And as Ten Cents was the first tug home, <laughs> he got it. Engineering parts were needed to go to Scuttlebutt Peak, the dredger, so they could start work first thing in the morning. I knew Ten Cents wasn't too happy, not because it was late, but because the Z-Stacks were on the same job. Hey, up, Zip. Look what the wind's blown in. Could eat two screws. Ahoy, Zog. Hey, where do you want this barge from the engineers? Too late for the day, mate. Too late? You don't need this till morning. We might have. No point now. I'll be dark soon. Don't bug me. I've had a busy day. Now, where do you want it? Really, Gabiba Zip, isn't he? Well, got a reputation to live up to, Zug. One of the best tugs in the harbour. Yawn, yawn. All work and no play makes ten cents a dull tug. Look, do you want this or do I take it back? More it by the old key. If you're not too worn out. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you old tub of guts. You can settle here for the night. Hello? Who's there? Oh, is that you, sunshine? Big Mac? Well, say, son, are you ever you are? I'm hearing things. Hold up, ten cents? Sunshine, it was you. Now, why didn't you answer? Was me what? In here, I called. Ah, I can't have heard you. You're heading home. What? Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, come on. Now, I must be tired. Night, Ten Cent. Night, Sunshine. Yeah, night, night, Grampus. That night, a shadowy vessel slid into the harbor. Aha. Uh -huh. This looks like what I'm after. Engineering parts. Unseen, unheard, the dark stranger hitched on Ten Cent's barge and slipped silently into the mist. Zip and Zug were in for a surprise the very next morning. Hey, where is it? I told Ten Cent to leave that barge here, Zip. Round by the old key, you said, Zug. Your very words. Always said Star Tugs couldn't be relied on. Oh, he'll catch it from Captain Star. Huh? <laughs> he will when I tell him. Land him right in it. Hey, you! What do you want? The words. Captain Star wants to see me. We want to see him as well. You didn't deliver our barge. Of course I did. It's not where it should be, is it? And we'll get the blame. But I delivered it. Yeah, I delivered it by the old key. You saw me. Not there now. You moved it to wind me up. You have double-crossed us. I have not. You take that back. Oh, no, 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 hang on, no. I was only double What's going on up there? Oh, uh, Captain Star, sir. Uh, Captain Star didn't deliver our barge last night. And, uh, I did. You know what did. You did not. It's not there. It's not, it's not there. It's not All right, there. that's enough. I've already had a complaint from the clients. On your way now. Uh, right, sir. Have a nice day, Ten Cents. <laughs> I don't expect slip-ups like this from you, Ten Cents. The owners claim their barge is missing, never delivered. That's not true, sir. It was my last time of the day. It was. At Ten Cents, I have to take the client's word. Sir, please, at least let me... No. I'm putting you on dredger detail with Scuttlebutt Pete. Oh, no, sir, not that. There's Ten no... Cents, go. Oh, hi, Scuttlebutt. You look gloomy this morning, Ten Cents. What's up? Oh, nothing. I knew you've lost a barge. Oh, you would be the first to know, wouldn't you? That's no secret. Talk of the harbour. Well, it's bound to be what you know. I've heard the rumour. Grampus, what do you know about it? Well, you've lost the barge. 
Oh, don't waste time, do you, Sculper? <laughs> Aye, rumours are his uh, speciality. It's only sign of hell. The more know about it, the sooner you'll be in the clear. I am in the clear. Get that clear. Naughty, naughty, temper, temper. Who's his stack if it wasn't screwed on? Oh, <laughs> one of these days. I'll oh, even ten cents. Captain Starr's got another job for you. Yeah, what is it? I don't think I'm gonna like it. More work with the Zen stuff. Oh, that's all I need. Now you do know what to do with that lot, don't you? He takes it somewhere and then it disappears. You can make a fortune selling large loads on the side. You saying I'm a crook? He wasn't talking about you, was we said? Didn't mention his name, Zach. Strange how ordinary people can suddenly turn criminals in. It's the evil inside and suddenly comes out, Zach. Yeah, you two'd know all about that, wouldn't you, Zach? And they can't take a joke, neither. You notice that, Zach? <laughs> it's no joke. Isn't that straight? I was worried. It wasn't like ten cents. But what else could it be? But fortunately for him, the famous Bridge Cafe band was giving Grampus one of his restless nights. So he decided to mosey round the harbour. He was worrying about ten cents too, and, and hoping he could find some way to help him clear his name. He didn't realise how soon that was to be. Boy, it's creepy round here at night. There's something moving over there. Better check it out. Another of ten cents parties. Where's the thief taking it? Grampus lost the barge snatcher in the mist and spent the rest of the night worrying who it could be. And all that time the thief was busy and other barges were disappearing. Next morning I told Captain Zero, Stars and Zed Stacks had to get together on this. I say, what's this all about? Starfleet and Zed be together, whatever next? We're wasting time. Silence! Ted says Barge is the only one's gone. Yeah, but he knows what it's about. Him stealing barges, that's what. Cut that out about ten cents. Yeah, what you say? Well, we didn't Just care about what you say. I said silence. silence. Captain Zero and me have had a meeting. Missing barges is serious. We're going to get to the bottom of it, understand? Captain Zero? And we have a scheme to catch this planet. Oh, I expect you know several. I see the group to catch a group. What are you suggesting? Quiet. We've decided to set a trap. Certain barges are being rigged with players that will trigger off if the parts is even touched. Never mind. Stolen. So, this is the plan. Tonight, you'll all be out in pairs, maintaining silence. Keep your eyes open. Captain Zero and Unknown to us, Grampus was searching where he'd lost the thief the night before. The forest here? What about this old warehouse? It's possible. It hasn't been used for years. You've done very well, Sir Paul Patrick, but we figure you still know us. You're going back on your word. You said that was the last barge. The thief. Change our mind, see. It's one more barge. Get it tonight or it's goodbye to him. Davy Jones is locked on the sea there. See? The missing barges. What's that? Hear anything? No. Right. Do what we say or else. It's getting too risky. One more, I say. Tonight. Don't do it. I've got to, haven't I? You promised tonight will be the last. Deliver on his sinks. You all right? Not hurt, are you? I'm okay, but don't do it. It's wrong. I can't leave you here with them all. Tonight will be the end. Oh dear. This is, is a sad state of affairs. That night, the plan to catch the pirate was put into action. Dash good idea, this. Barge in place. Player set to go off. Now, I thought we were going to be in pairs. Oh, no, not warrior. This is our post-torpedo. Sorry, little fella. 
Oh, all the tugs. I get the clubs. It'd be great if you and I catch them. Mm, how thrilling. How absolutely thrilling. Now, pay attention, warrior. This is a wartime situation. I'll must up my cunning, my sense of tactical advantage. Now, back there. We're certainly tactical. It means thinking strategically. We're certainly strategic over what you said. Tactical, you dummy. Yeah. Tactical. Strategical. Strength. Positions, warrior! Yes, the double! This is a nice tactical spot. Quite strategic. Quite good, eh? Hey, cheer up, ten cents. Now I know you didn't have anything to do with the missing barges. Zip and Zug are trying to make something of it, that's all. Yeah, thanks, sunshine. But he makes me angry, you know, not being able to prove it. I'm sure Captain Starr believes you. And don't pay any attention to the Z stacks. That troublemaker is rubbing you up the wrong way. I don't care about them. It's our gang. Well, I can't be sure it's not me. Well, I'll catch the thief tonight. <laughs> With any luck. Yeah, we might. We might not. But if we do, I'll sit that fire up. Hey, yes, sir. Oh, what's Grandma's doing here? He'll give us away. Grandma's, get out of it. You're in the way. Well, Liam, a trap for the thief. That's why I've come to see you. I've been trying to find you for ages. Yeah, what do you know? Where the stolen barges are? I've been there. Seen them. Well, let's get a pirate. He'll be sorry you crossed me, I'll tell you. Just a minute, Ten Cents. It's a bit complicated. I want him now. To prove he's not me. Will you listen a minute? Your pirate is a tug called Sea Rogue. Tug? Tied off my end. Right, Zip. I'll stay back here, out of sight. You keep a lookout up front. Oh, why do I have to be up front? It's scary. I feel vulnerable. You come here, I'll come there. Hmm? Oh, no! You'd be much worse off here. Better there, believe me. Is it really bad over there? Honestly, Zip, would I lie to you? Now would I? Oh, oh, please, Mr. Pirate! I don't mean no harm! I don't... No, 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 please, Doug, it's me! Zip! Stupid! Captain Zero said we're not to move. You nearly scared me. If that's only nearly. I'd hate to see you really scared. Get to your post. I only wanted to see if it is better back there. Well, it isn't. Stay there and shut up. And Sea Rogue is being forced against his will. The real villains have got the old tug and are threatening to scuttle him if Sea Rogue doesn't feel bargained for them. Oh, what do I do? Get to the pirate Sea Rogue. Or before the others. No time to explain to them. You're right. Follow me. Zug, quiet. You'll give us away. Ten cents and sunshine are leaving their post. What? Zug. You're right. That ten cents must be up to something. I knew he shouldn't be trusted. Come on. See them for mist. Stay close or I'll leave you behind. Oh, thanks, pal. Thanks very much indeed. The villains were carefully laying plans for their escape. They were covering up light ships. Putting out lights in lighthouses. And muffling bellboys so they wouldn't be seen or heard when they sailed off with their loot. Well, boys, all right. Oh, what their loot, the old tub, wasn't known. Ten cents, Sunshine and Grampus were hiding by the old warehouse. They had seen the villains re-enter and were now waiting to spring their trap on the pirate. Not much around tonight. I've got to find what they want. Time is running out. Too spooky for my liking. I wish I was back working up river. Shh, shh, huh? be quiet. I think I hear something. Uh, I'm not gonna make it. Nothing in sight. The top fleets have rumbled me. Hey, Tom Zero! You're cornered. You can't escape. I'm not trying to. Well done, Ten Cents. He's a pirate, all right? No, I'm not a real pirate. We know you're not. Jump has taught us everything. He saw you and those two green-eyed things. Did you see the old man there, too? Everything. We must save him. He's my uncle. They're holding him to ransom. To make me steal barges. Even if I get one more, they might still sink him. Well, help us to help you. And we'll sink them. Yeah. Anything you say. Who's that? Quick! Let's hide! 
This way. Pinsets can't be far. Must be around here somewhere, Zip. So could that pirate, Zuck. Maybe we should get back. I don't like this, Zuck. Quiet. Zip and Zug. They're stupid enough to go in the warehouse. They'll get no quarter if they do. Ah, sir, them right. That gives me an idea. Grumpus, go to the warehouse entrance. If the villains leave the shed, save the old man. Now let's see what's going on. Just a quick look. No, Zark. Let's go back. Please. Come on. Stay close. Oh, don't worry. I will. Oh, I didn't know it was so dark inside. Means there's no one there. Hey! The stolen badge is great! We're cracking! We're heroes! <laughs> it's your heart! Oh, <laughs> Hey! What are you doing here? The pirate! Oh, no! Two of them! Yes, I'm cracking! Right, now get ready to spring the trap on our side. Yeah. Well, unless our grandpa has got a clear path. <laughs> Everything's okay. What the? Who's that? Easy, old man. I've come to set you free. Here they come. Don't move yet. Right. Wait, wait till I say. They're getting close. Wait, wait, not yet. Three, two, one, two! Gotcha! The game's up. There's no escape. Hey, Top Hat, something's going on over there. I'll take a look. What are What are Watch that! Flare! Bright spark warrior! Some flare! In the morning, a slightly singed top hat and warrior led the villains away. Don't bump them too hard, warrior. They might send up a flare too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, now that's what I call good night's work. You heading up River Sea Road? Yeah, thanks, Ten Cents. Uh, that's all right, at least I could do. Right then, we better move. Pirates are not welcome here. Nonsense, you're no pirate. Thank you all for your help. Yes, thanks for everything. Come on, old man, let's get you home. Oh, help me now, it's... I'm really sad to see them go. Hi, Hercules. Ten cents. Those the two you rescued last night. Yeah, they helped us find the stolen barges. Captain Star says you've done a great job, Ten Cents. Well, I couldn't have done it without Grandpa's and Sunshine. Well, good work, my dears. Thanks, Hercules. Thanks, Hercules. Well, I'm off to get some rest. Thanks, Grandpa's. Zip and Zug. I want a word with them. Yeah, well, I don't know what we'd have done without your help. Well... <laughs> Somebody had to flush them out, so uh, we did. <laughs> we never really thought you stole the barges. Oh, no. <laughs> Could have fooled me. Weren't you just a little bit scared? No. Nothing scares us, does it, Zip? No. Forward, don't forward the barge! <laughs> They move pretty fast when they're not scared. <laughs> they certainly do. <laughs>